Hi students, this is Alex here. In this problem, they have given f of z as e per z and we have to show u and v are harmonic functions. Let's take f of z which is e per z and z is x plus i y. So always z is x plus i y. So this can be split into two parts e power x into e power i y. Again we can use e power i theta formula which is cos theta plus i sin theta. So this becomes e power x bracket open cos y plus i sin y. So this is our f of z. Now we split into two part e power x into cos y plus i into e power x into sin y. So we get real part u is e power x into cos y and v is imagine part e power x into sin y. From this we can get ux that is y is a constant e power x is e power x and constant cos y is kept as it is and vx will be derivative of e power x is e power x and sin y is a constant which is kept as it is. Then uy is e power x is a constant and this is minus sin y and vy is e power x is constant and derivative of sin y is cos y. So from this we can see this ux equal to vy. So ux equal to vy and we can also see uy is minus times of vx. So uy equal to minus vx. So partial derivatives, partial derivatives are continuous and they satisfy CR equation. They satisfy CR equations. And let's find u x x. u x x is again y is a constant, so e power x into cos y. Then u y y will be derivative of y, so e power x into minus sin y derivatives minus cos y. Again, v x x is e power x derivatives e power x and sin y stay as it is. And v y y also e power x is a constant kept as it is and derivative of cos y is minus sin y. Now when I take u x x plus u y y we find e power x cos y plus e power x into minus cos y that is equal to 0. Similarly v x x plus v y y will be e power x into sin y plus e power x into minus sin y and that becomes 0. So they, they satisfy the Laplace equation. They satisfy Laplace equation and hence f of z is harmonic. So we have to prove the given function u and v are harmonic functions. So we proved it here. So instead of saying f of z, let's say hence u and v are harmonic.